everyone welcome to our Tuesday class how is our all my superheroes doing today has anybody seen super kid I haven't seen him all morning I bet he's having his breakfast what do you think well today we have this hi Miss Morris hi super kid welcome to class thank you how are you doing today I am great thank you I haven't seen you for a long time I've been here. Do you call it sick? No. I have done some errands to do. Do you know what that means? Lots of work. I thought it was fun. It is fun. Planning. So how's fun working? Well, planning Do you play you? with the mat? <laughs> no. Do you play with toys? No. Do you play with arcade? No. I play with my computer and with the pencil, paper, scissors. <laughs> I won. Okay, you won. Well, would you like to um, know about our story today? Why a story? Oh, I have a fun story about our five senses. How about instead of reading, we just do an experiment today. Okay. Well, what do you guys think? Should we do this? I think we should. Okay. Do you want to start first, or how should we do this then? Hmm. Let's see. We all know we have five senses, correct? That's correct. One is seeing. Yes, like smelling. I see you. Smell. Smell. That's right. That's two. What's Taste. Taste. That's right. What's that? Touch. Touch. That's right. Mm. What's our fifth? Hearing. That's right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, Good mm -hmm. job. So, what do you smell? Tell me. What can we smell? Breakfast. Breakfast. That's right. Are you hungry again? Lunch. That's right. Now. Dinner. And dinner. You can also. Burritos. <laughs> Cookies? Okay, I, I get it. He needs his morning snack already. Uh, can you smell this? It smells like wax. No, it smells like cherries. That's one of our senses. See? It smells good, right? It's one of my favorite smells. Is that what you use at school? You can. Can I use it when I... You can actually... Well, can I use it when I don't take a shower? No. Not Only fun. an adult can use this, okay? Now you can also smell such things as, do you know what this is? Fruit. That's right, but what kind of fruit? The one that you can eat. <laughs> this is a strawberry. Can you smell the strawberry? Do you like strawberries? I love strawberries. Now can you smell this fruit? Kind of hard to smell that one. But do you know what this is? Food. It's food, that's right. What kind of food it is? The one that goes to your belly? <laughs> and this is a grape. And do you know the grapes have a crunch to them when you bite? Do you know they can make wine with it? How do you know? 
secret. Okay, I'm sure your daddy knows how to make wine. Now I saw people stepping on grapes. You see them? That's right. That's the way that they used to do it back in the days, right? I guess. Okay. Now. Wait, 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 wait. So, we talk about smell. That's right. And I saw you have food in there. Yes. And that, I think, can go along with the next step. That's right. Taste. Yeah. You can taste a strawberry. Mm hmm You can taste a juicy grape. Grape. That's right. Now, can you taste a candle? I don't think it will be something <laughs> really nice to taste. That's right. Now, I have a question for you. Go ahead. How come we cannot taste water? Water is not supposed to have a taste. It's just no flavor into it. Now, a water is just to feel the taste. Well, so, uh, you know what? I think you can taste the difference between the clean water and the dirty water. You don't want to drink dirty water. Well, right? you can taste the one with the sub too. I guess. And you can make bubbles. <laughs> but I don't think you will like that. And you can put a little bit of, some people like to put the water with strawberries and it tastes very, very good. I think you need to give us an example what it tastes the strawberry, Miss Loris. How about you? No. Okay. We'll do it at, at snack time. Now, we talk about smell. Mm -hmm. We talk about taste. taste. So that's two but of our senses. You were doing something else at the same time. And that is? Touching. Touching, that's you correct. You were touching the bottle. You were touching the strawberries. That's right. You were touching the grapes. That's right. Now, here's a question for you. Yes. Is the water cold or hot? This water is actually very cold. I like very cold water. Can you feel? It's very cold. So that's also touch feeling, correct? Yes, and also feels wet because it's, see the bottle is so cold and with the temperature outside of the, the fridge, um, it starts to sweat and it feels a little wet. So that you're also, you know, feeling. Hmm. So actually touch is pretty helping because you can tell the difference of the shapes, is that correct? That's correct. So let's see, you touch a bottle and you touch a coat. That's right. Now, how about you touch the next thing and you tell me if it's hot, cold, or just neutral. Okay. So the next thing I have here is my favorite little puppy. And it feels fluffy, like you can squeeze it. Mm -hmm. And it feels very soft. See, you feel it. Very soft. But now, it's not hot. But it's not hot. It's but it's not cold. It's not cold. So it's, it's a neutral. A neutral. Touch. That's right. Now, um, if you feel the difference of the eyes, of the, so it feels a little bit like the plastic, and then the material is very nice and soft. So when you touch the eyes, it touch as a hard feeling. That's correct. Now when you touch the rest of it, it's a soft feeling. That's correct. See? It's okay. the same like my glasses. See, they feel like the metal here and then the, there's the glass. It feels very different. Hmm. Now, with this, we were doing something else at the same time. Yes. What was that? The next step is about seeing. That's correct. So we were seeing the strawberries strawberries at the same time we touching the strawberry that's right and it feels a little bit rough because of the little seeds that I have and we also were smelling the strawberry yes and they smell delicious and also we can taste it that's correct we were seeing the puppy the mini puppy of course we were seeing the candle Feeling the outside of the candle. And also? And smelling the inside of the candle. That's correct. 
but we cannot taste that. That's correct. I don't think you would like to taste it. Now, we can tell the difference and we see the different colors, but there's one with you missing. And what's that? We haven't covered that. Well, we probably have at the moment because I'm doing this right now. Can you hear me? Can we hear him? That will be our last sense, the hearing. That's correct. Now, hearing is so important because when you're going to, like, let's say you're crossing the street with your mommy and daddy, you want to see and hear of the cars that are coming, right? Mm hmm Of when we are speaking to each other, mm hmm to hear. But now, do you know if you can't hear, then we can speak in sign language, right? Also, a lot of people who have lost hearing, they're based on touching. Exactly. So, now, can you hear this? Breakfast! <laughs> Breakfast, that's right. So we have cover, let's see. Visual. Mm -hmm. What's the next one? Smelling. Smelly. Food. Tasting. Which means tasting. Hearing. Hearing. And visual. And visual. And those are our five senses. They're so important in our everyday life. Right? Mm -hmm. Super Kid, you are amazing. Thank you for helping me teach this class today. That's not a problem. All right, everybody, have a beautiful day. See you soon. Have a good day. And remember, wash your hands and use sanitizer, especially in these moments. That's good. Be safe. We love you. Bye.